Hey guys, a warm welcome to another baking video. If you're new to this channel, I'm Elsie Nika and do feel at home. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel and remember to turn on the notification bell. So whenever I upload a new video, you'll be the first to be notified and to watch my videos. If you are a returning subscriber, Karibu Nyumbani, I appreciate your support and I love you right back. So guys, in today's video, we're going to be baking this kind of fish. It's called tilapia, perege or ngege in my local language. And since the intestines and the scales were already removed, I'm just going to make sure the gills are clean, wash it and remove extra scales. I'll then go ahead to prepare the spices and the sauces to be used to marinate this fish before we bake it. So here we have our curry powder, turmeric, paprika, cumin seeds, dried rosemary, and black pepper. We have our fresh garlic and we have our ginger. We will also be needing some lemon juice, some coriander leaves, bulbs of onion, and you can also use as many as you want depending on what you want. We have our fish. And here we have our olive oil and our soy sauce. I then go ahead to mix everything together except the onions and the coriander. I then go ahead to chop my onions, coriander, and one tomato that I added to the list. Since my fish was too big for my bowl, I'll be using my baking pan for marination and for baking. After greasing my pan, I place my fish and make sure to shallow slice your fish before applying the mixture. Apply it on the skin, mouth, gills and inside the belly and make sure to turn the fish and do the same. After that, I'll go ahead to stuff some onions, coriander and tomato inside the belly and inside the mouth and sprinkle some on top of it. Just look at this fish, guys. You'll think that it's ready, but you're not there yet. I'll then cover my fish, set it aside, and let it marinate for at least two hours. But remember, guys, the longer you let something marinate, the yummier it is. After pre-eating my oven at 200 degrees, I'm going ahead to put my fish and bake it for 30 minutes. Tell you what guys, when my fish was ready, I opened my oven, sprinkled some coriander, let it there for about a minute and removed it. And now this is our final product. Just take a look at this guys.
and guys as you come to the end of this video i just want to take some few seconds and appreciate you guys for your support thank you guys for subscribing to my channel thank you for your likes thank you for your comments and please 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 if you've not subscribed to my youtube channel please just support a babe subscribe to my channel and remember to turn on the notification bell so i never upload a new video you'll be the first to be notified and to watch my videos i appreciate you guys and i love you so much until our next video guys bye